I've gone ahead and ordered a new tool for the shop. It's an induction heater. This one's from Ally Express. So, here's what you get. For your £327 plus change, you get the induction heater unit itself, which looks remarkably similar to another nameless uh, company's uh, induction heater. You don't get a British plug. I've already put a British plug on it. It comes with a crappy moulded European plug. Yeah, a basic set of some larger coils, some smaller, no, there's some smaller coils, and a wrap around coil for wrapping around odd shaped objects. So, let's see how it works. Okay, this is really, really easy to use, like even I can work it. You undo the two thumb screws, poke a coil in, like that. You tighten up your two work screws, and you poke this bit over whatever it is you want to heat up, and you squeeze the power button, and it heats up. Let's see how it works. Right, here I've set up your typical not on a bolt type of effort, but in the vice because I've only got two hands. We'll slide this inductor over here and we'll squeeze the button and we'll see how, how hot it can get or how long it takes. Well, there's smoke coming off it. I can feel the heat. I can hear it cooking. Oh, it's changing colour. Starting to change, it's gone green. Hold on, I'll pull it out and see the nuts change colour. Oh, there's a good heat off it now. In fact, I'm going to put the light out and let you see it change colour. Oh, we've been plunged into darkness. Look at that, glowing red hot. No problem. That's good. I'm impressed. Now, let's see how much power I actually pull. So it's rated at one kilowatt. So let's see how much power it uses when it's actually doing work. Five hundred ish watts, but that might change depend on the size of the coil that you're using or how long you're using it for. But I say that's not bad. There we go. For three hundred of your English pounds, you can have one of these induction heaters from AliExpress. I'd also like to point out that I paid full cash money, the whole price. I haven't been given any product placement, and also mine arrived not working. This had detached from the circuit board inside when it arrived, so I had to take it to bits and resold it on the board. But after that, it's working fine. I mean, 300 quid is significantly cheaper than the next one that you get. And I'm, I'm impressed. I mean, it, it heats things up quickly. It's, it is pretty much a copy of the other company's mini inductor, but hey, it's China. So if you need a mini induction heater, maybe give this one a try.